Welcome to Drawfee, where we take your dumb ideas and make even dumber drawings. I'm Karina. I'm Jacob. And I'm Julia. And I'm Jonah. What's oh, up? Oh, shit. Holy Jonah's crap. Jonah's back. Back by popular demand. Yes. <laughs> the people were at the gates of Drawfee HQ rattling the fences. Yeah, please stop doing that. And Willy Wonka like, I stumble from the factory and tumble yeah. in front of you and stand up. <laughs> <laughs> we are here to make your creations. Jonah, Julia feud, not real. Not real. Not We're real. here together. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Jonah, I have no idea who you are. Do you want to tell me and also other people who don't know who you are? I'm surprised. I do know who you are. I'm surprised. Uh, yeah. yeah. Who you are and what you do? Sure, sure. My name is Jonah Scott. I am a uh, voice actor. I am a Twitch streamer. Um, I voice uh, a lot of characters in anime and uh, some of your favorite characters from video games. I do commercials, all kinds of stuff. Uh, but today, I am in a different capacity here. I <gasps> am going to be a VTuber. Whoa. Oh, my God. Yeah, you digitized. You're going to mm -hmm. become anime? I am become even more anime than you can possibly imagine. Wow. wow. That's so exciting. <laughs> Thank you. I think so, too. I've been doing a lot of... Uh, I wanted to approach this very genuinely, too. I didn't want to become as like, you know, this is a voice actor who's jumping on a VTuber train. No. <laughs> I, I, I spent like six to ten months doing a lot of research, uh, participating Ooh. genuinely in a bunch of like VTubers chats, trying to you know work with them in certain capacities. And I, I didn't want to come off as just a dude who was following a trend. This is something that I actually genuinely care about. And it's just a derivative of things that I've been doing my entire life, like radio and uh, doing Ooh. things on, on stage and in front of a camera. Um, so it's just a combination of all three. And then you sprinkle a little bit of anime magic on top. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. I'm so excited for you. That's going to be so yeah, that's rad. that's great. Jonah Scott, genuine VTuber. Thanks. Thanks. Yeah, <laughs> I, I try. Hand over my heart. Oh, hey, what's up? It's me, Jonah Scott, here with the Shameless Plug. This episode was recorded a hot minute ago, and I have since debuted my VTuber. His name is Alphonse McKenzie, and he's got a cool-ass snail. Check him out. Isn't that sweet? You can come find me almost every day after 5 p.m. streaming on twitch.tv slash alpha anarchy, A-L-P-H-A-A-N-I-K-I. -A -A okay, so they're probably going to cut me off here in just a second. So in the spirit of you becoming a VTuber, today on the show, you are going to help us to create some brand new VTubers based on a variety of concepts. Is that correct? Correct. In my research, my vast half year long research, I have discovered several common threads throughout uh, VTuberdom. And uh, I figured that I would, you know, throw them at you as you fantastic character designers you all are. I've been working with uh, Karina actually on, on doing some art of my VTuber and uh, it's, it, it's looking fantastic. I would like to see what you guys would come up with. I figured yeah. it would be a neat little thing because every VTuber that I have seen has been unique in some way. That's awesome. Okay. Yeah. I'm well, ready, Jonah. I'm we got first. brains. Yeah. Okay. The first trait as I was researching VTubers and, and participating in, in, in the various communities is a lot of them seem to be inspired in sort of maybe a parody aspect, but a parody aspect that is kind of like a gimmick that gets people to watch. A lot of them have just been moe anthropomorphic random objects uh yes friend of mine i kid you not this is uh, their actual name uh her name is truck chan and uh, oh, okay. she is an an moe anthropomorphic semi-truck and uh That's you, can go, you can go check her out right now she's fantastic uh, she's a burgeoning vtuber uh and it does what it says on the tin um, her gimmick is that she isekais all the protagonists. She's the one that puts them into the isekai and makes them into the, that's how that's her anime touch. Oh uh, hell there. yeah! Um, but I actually have in front of me a wheel of random objects that I'm going to spin on. But here we go. You are going to be drawing can of peas, Chan. Oh, oh. yes. You're going to be drawing can of, can of peas. peas, Chan. I love that. Uh, she is a moe anthropomorphic can of peas. She does everything a can of peas can do. Yeah, and, and especially <laughs> play League of Legends at diamond level. That is what <laughs> can of peas Chan does very well. Um, that's another thing that I've noticed is they're all like, you know, I'm a, I'm a shrine maiden that eats Doritos and is also a gremlin. <laughs> <laughs> I would be so insulted if can of peas had a better score than me you know, better like KD. I would yeah. be too, honestly. I mean, I can't believe I'm getting beat by I can't believe I'm getting beat by this freaking can of peas. And the best part about VTubers <laughs> is there are uh, certain toggles and switches and things that you can press in order to change how your VTuber looks and how they're presented. So I would imagine can of peas, Sean, also has like, oh, I'm open. 
oh great you know my my my, my head is spilling oh, out yeah. I'm tipped over Ooh, wow. yeah like I'm you get open. so mad it like <laughs> pops it like bubbles up watch out for botulism <laughs> <laughs> Don't, don't 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 open up the swollen canopies, John. When she's sad, it like tips over, and a little bit of like the pea juice comes out. Oh, like the top. It's, yeah, you're crying pea juice. Ew. A little more slippery. Oh my God. Not pea, not pea, but pea. Just, yeah. just so you know, it's not the, not the other way around. It's not. Yeah, not juice. urine. <laughs> no, yeah, not, not, not urine. Don't get it twisted. What else is on Food, this fucking not pee. object generator? Uh, let me let me let me roll it again. Let's see. Oh, you're just rolling it again. You're going crazy. I don't know. Over I'm just there. looking. I, I'm, I'm curious to see what's in here. Oh, this one's cute. Puddle Chan. Puddle Chan. Aww. Aww. That's that's a, that immediately conjures up a picture of someone very sad. Okay, <laughs> I've, I've decided I'm gonna go fast and I'm gonna do three. You you're just three? drew a can of peas. I'm not done. I'm not done. <laughs> yeah, where's the moe anthropomorphism? Yeah. Well, I, I want. I think I want can of peas, Chan, to have sort of a. Like a muscular. Oh yeah. Yes. Can of like peas on the keys. Yeah, on the key. He's just ripped standing there with these go. huge shoulders. He plays oh, Dark no. Souls. <laughs> yeah. Does Dark Souls challenge runs only? <laughs> hey, what's up? It's me, Can of Peace, John. Here with another Dark oh, Souls oh, speed run. God. We hit our sub goal. We're gonna get Elden Ring. Jacob, <laughs> I have a question. Yeah. Does he have Jiggle? Oh, absolutely. Oh okay. oh, thank God. Jiggle physics. To. I want it to look like this dude's head is just... <laughs> Crammed in a can. <laughs> his, his lore is that he got his head stuck in a giant can of Yeah, he just tripped peas. and fell. Yeah. And he can't get it out, yeah. so he's just accepted. Big, but... like, three, like, pound can of peas. Yeah. No, it happened when he was a small child. <laughs> he just kind of grew into it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there's a, there's a toggle that has the can of peas that's off and his head is just like <laughs> shaped like if you like take out dog food no. it's like that cylindrical. <laughs> Poor can of peas, John. Yeah, here's a little artist representation of. of yeah, his he's just like, head like, in there. like a muppet. Well, like a <laughs> <laughs> It's a top five percent on Twitch, can of peas, John. <laughs> it's like a Hey Arnold character. <laughs> oh no, I love can of peas, John. And that's great can too because you got like you key. got most VTubers are presented from like the nip up, and uh, that's that's fantastic. You already have it's the just... bust there. <laughs> he stands up. It's a larger can of peas yeah. covering the His nip torso. Down. Yeah, it's like like one of those like old timey like destitute barrel men yes <laughs> yeah. wow jacob i threw my phone oh, on the ground party i'm sorry foul. Uh, i'm gonna do puddle chan now okay puddle chan <laughs> which i think is gonna be like obviously a puddle yes <laughs> yeah. like moe anime eyes yeah adorable yes. oh, like those very sparkly crying eyes with yeah. anime eyes and and boobies yeah, okay, you gotta perfect. have the jiggle physics. You gotta bring them in somehow. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so just a big, big old, <laughs> big old water balloons. <laughs> big old pair on the on the puddle. <laughs> they and also kind of look like Garfield eyes right now. But yeah, <laughs> Garfield's pissed. <laughs> oh, yeah, and then I'll do the anime. Big beautiful anime eyes. Oh, you know that puddle chan and. Peas Anaki stream together so often. They have to. They got to do a collab. The debut collab yeah. is uh, Peas Anaki and, and Puddle Chan. There's a ship <laughs> there waiting to happen, I feel. Oh, like. yeah. I really got to work on my anime eyes game. There's like so many things you can put in them, like sparkles and gradients and... <laughs> I well, feel there's like that I don't thing. know all the ways. It's like the 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 new hack or like the hack that was going around for the a Among while. Us? The Among Us. Oh yeah, you put the Among oh, Us in yeah. there, and then it's yeah. got Have anime eyes that? there. That's I was I was I was oh, yeah. actually like work? googling anime eyes meme to try and find out what it was that they put in there that made it like the hack. But yeah, it's uh, you put a little bogus in there, and <laughs> Look, it's perfect. <laughs> it just works. <laughs> <laughs> Man, oh my god! Puddle Chan looking a little sus. <laughs> why is that? Why is that so good? I. It works. It just works. 
All right. Puddle chant's definitely one of those puddles that you think is like really shallow, but actually it's like several. It's like Super a deep. it's like a pothole. Yeah. There's a lot. Yeah. There's a lot to Puddle Chan. It's she has she's a lot not of shallow depth. at all. She does have a lot of depth. Yeah. <laughs> the, the cleavage looks like a like a little mouth. I have to fix that. There's some detail. There it does look like a mouth. I was I was gonna be like, is that mouth. the mouth? But well, now it just looks like she has those like big like cat cheeks, like the eyes and then oh, the cat yeah. cheeks. Oh yeah. Oh, there we go. Hey, okay. there we go. Yeah, we'll she's just mouth. happy you're here. You know. <laughs> <laughs> So I did, in my research, I was curious where this entire, it was called the uh, VTuber Uprising, right? Um, there was yeah. a point in time where the line go up for VTubers and it, it was insane. And I, I was wondering who the first one was. And there is a lot, a lot of discourse. There is a lot of, um, actually oh. Andy's in chat and in, in comment sections that are be like, actually, this is the first VTuber. This is the first VTuber. There are two schools of thought um, from what I have seen. Kizuna Ai is the first one to have... That's what Jacob uh, told me was the first one. Yeah, yeah. and our yeah. only other VTuber episode, that was my claim, was that Kizuna Ai was the first one. But was yeah. he right? See, that she's the first one to have used the term virtual YouTuber, like VTuber, and the first one to popularize the genre. But if you go back and look at like a mechanical, from a mechanical, like etymological standpoint there is a uh a visual novel company nitro plus they had their own mascot uh that was supersonico and you probably know who supersonico oh, is oh that's yeah. where she's from yeah um uh she's a mascot there and uh she is used she's used a lot in like figmas there's a lot of figures of her she has very ample yeah. bosoms um, yeah mm -hmm. big naturals easy to see easy to <laughs> sell but they're they're one of the first ones and uh okay. i figured that that was really interesting piece of piece of history there but kizuna i was one of the first ones to get mega popular with a two-dimensional vtuber rig um the one who and says then fuck. do content gotcha should G we get give me give me one, one more, more. Yeah, one let more me, let me knock out one more one real more quick. object okay let me let me ro ro roll on the r wheel of random objects here handheld game system chan <laughs> Handheld game system, Sean. Okay. Oh, Gonna go retro like with a, the like uh, a BMO. Yeah, kind of like a BMO, I guess. Yeah, from Adventure Time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we're gonna but get Moe. A... But, but Moe. Moe. Okay. I'm gonna Is go that a Game the... Boy Advance? I see. Uh, yeah, classic Game Boy Advance <laughs> shape. I like it. I love the Game Boy Advance. I love its little shape. It's cool looking. <laughs> I love its little shape. I love its little shape. It's that, just, that body of yours is... That body of you is, is absolutely absurd. <laughs> it's absolutely absurd. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. <laughs> that body of yours is absurd. Me looking at the Game Boy Advance. Yeah, looks at Game Boy Advance. Question mark? I am now obsessed with you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this trio, man. Move over Hololive. Like, yeah. Move done. over V Shoujo. A new group is in town. Yeah. They're truly, freaking dead. Truly, when is Drawfee going to do V... v, v it's only a yeah. matter of time, actually. I was apprehensive at first to do... This is why I did a lot of research. I was like, do I really want to make this happen? But, um, yeah. I mean, as an, as an actor, I feel like it's a really cool experiment. Um, it's a really neat opportunity to be able to present yourself in a different light that isn't... It's a character you own. That's one of the things that really drew me to the entirety of VTubing. I could reinvent myself. People can yeah. still know it's me, but at the same you time... become your own OC. Become your own OC, exactly. That I mean, is I'm, powerful. I'm writing a graphic novel right now about my VTuber. It's, it's kind of like started to become something bigger than me. We're talking to Japanese uh, publishing companies and, and, and comic uh -huh. companies in the West to, to like publish this stuff from... So it's becoming a lot bigger than I anticipated, but it's nice to have that ownership, right? And not have like, yeah. I voice a lot of characters, m most of which, if not all of which are not mine. Uh, but this is something that I really own and something that I can, I can, uh, you know, commission art of and not feel, feel weird about <laughs> it. And I have to ask Toei Animation or something if I can get permission to do this. This is like <laughs> something I own. And uh, it's, I, I'm sure that people who aren't actors feel this is a really cool way to experiment creatively and and start to develop their own, you know, universe and work with your friends and 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 develop your own stories together. I mean, even sitting here, we're kind of parodying and memeing on like, you know, Puddle Chan and Peas Chan and Game Boy Advance Sama. But it's a real thing. People get together in Discords and 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 start to invent their own stories and and get creative. Yeah. And that's something that I I'm a huge champion of. Yeah, that's what we do every episode of Drawfee. Yeah. True. Yeah. Although I've never been more sold on 
wanting to make my own VTuber than when Karina just said, make your own OC. I was like, be your own OC. Be your own OC. I'm like, ooh, do what? Now I'm interested. (laughs) <laughs> yeah now all of a sudden sounds we pretty good we could literally good. do it we've come up with a bunch of horrible vtuber concepts in the past we can just try them out yeah i have a whole show of original characters <laughs> i could be my little gremlin ogilvy yes you could <laughs> what if you could be a cute guy inside of a game boy screen this is adorable i love that that's a great idea i yeah. like having the, the the idea of having like the game boy be the actual entity and on the inside the expressions are just this like cute little k-pop guy <laughs> yeah he's got his expression he's like i imagine he would be like a pixel art yeah uh, little oh. guy no, i can't really do that in this you know sketch but that's the that's the gist now you have to do it in the render in in the render i will make him a a pixel art guy okay okay yeah i you love better that not forget reminds me of I'll those old uh, warrior wear <laughs> games that made you like repeat the uh characters like bit crushed line in order to like yeah. get it accurate yes. and it sounded nothing like what they originally started off with <laughs> that's great yeah where it goes <laughs> that was wario apparently uh but yeah <laughs> I really like all of these. I hope someone takes inspiration and yeah. all of these become yeah. real VTubers. You are yeah. allowed to become peas on a key. Peas on a key. He's, fuck, he's I, yoked, dude. He I, is know, I might keep that one for myself. I really resonate yeah, okay. with Yeah, okay. Do not steal peas on a key. <laughs> and the sound it makes when he takes his... <laughs> his, his, his helmet off. Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful. Well, great job, Jacob. Thank yeah, you. Beautiful. I love all of these. Uh, should we get Karina in? I Let would me love in. that. Tap okay. her in. In my vast journey through the uh-huh. universe of VTubers, <laughs> I have noticed a large amount of VTubers, while very unique in outcome, a not insignificant amount of these characters are just a combination of Valorant agents and Genshin Impact characters. You cracked the code. <laughs> the complicated outfits of Genshin Impact characters and, and the personality and the way people hold themselves of, of, of Valorant agents. So, in solidarity with a good friend of mine, Alejandro Saab, who is also a, a voice actor and is also a VTuber, Sayu, he recently got cast in Genshin Impact as Sino, um, oh. who is a, a sort of like Egyptian-inspired character. Again, very complicated outfit in my opinion it does look very crazy hard to do and then i have another friend uh jason marnocha who voices omen in valorant so i offer you the challenge of combining omen and sino i love that jonah went this character really complicated (laughs) karina you have it To to be fair sino doesn't wear a shirt if that means anything greatly i drew a puddle with tits Okay, so we're going to mash these two up design-wise, but the character lore is going to be completely unrelated. Oh, yeah, we're going to establish that. I know you're keeping the dog ears. You gotta. Uh. My VTuber, uh, to some extent, when I was designing (laughs) them, uh, and I'm sure Karina is very familiar, um, but I had to figure out what my audience was. I had to figure out, uh, Uh. you know, you see where we're going. Um, yeah. Not only that, but he's when it comes to his design, he's heavily inspired by things that I that I enjoy. We sat down with the character designer and we're like, "Hey, uh, what do you like?" His backstory is almost entirely based on like mid '60s to early 2000s rock and roll, like classic rock. Um, and oh. even though he lives in Tokyo in like 2122 in like a cyberpunk kind of future, a lot of what he does is analog music. So he plays drums. He has like reel to reels in his room. Uh, he listens to like old classic rock, like ACDC and stuff on vinyl. It's very hard to get and very hard to maintain nowadays. And mm-hmm. he has wolf ear headphones. Um, yep. So nice. we have to maintain yeah. all that kind of like imagery and stuff like that, just to make sure that I'm not alienating any of my audiences. Oh, also he has a giant <laughs> hard light claw. <laughs> nice. I did misunderstand you when you said 21, 22. I realize now that that is the entire year. I thought you meant like 2021, 2022. Oh, oh, okay. and I was no, like, no, no. I was like, a hundred okay. years in the future. Yeah. <laughs> it like... was one of my character notes when I was doing some designs for Jonah. I was like, does he have ears? <laughs> or is he a cat boy? <laughs> he does have ears. They're just ear, like wolf ear shaped headphones. Um, and they add a little bit of personality. 
too. Yeah, I like them. Make them taller too. <laughs> you guys want a fun, uh, fun VTuber fact? Yeah. Yes. yes. VTubing content uh, in the past two years, thirty-eight percent of the top grossing YouTube channels, the most profitable YouTube channels, thirty-eight percent of them were VTubers dedicated. Whoa! Wow. Isn't that wild? That's wild. Yeah. That is crazy to think about. Up, up there with Markiplier, up there with PewDiePie. You have this set up there of, with Drawfee. With Drawfee. <laughs> you have this set of, of VTubers. I you think share you're forgetting a space. someone, Jonah. <laughs> I could never forget you. You were next out of my mouth, I promise. Uh -huh. But uh yeah, and um there are there are they were in well, VTubers have been in Forbes. They are uh, I Iron Mouse, uh friend of my show, Iron Mouse. Uh, yeah. has accumulated the the largest number of paid subscriptions on any platform. Uh, second yeah. only to Ludwig. And we all know we, who Ludwig is. We Great drew guy. Iron Mouse on our VTuber. Oh, yeah. We sure did, yeah. yeah. Okay, Or okay. attempted to. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I definitely messed that one up. <laughs> that was me. But she liked it. She did, yeah. Yeah, we, we all knew a lot less about VTubers than, than we do now. I mean... Maybe Karina knew the same amount then and now. <laughs> I I've known VTubers for a while. I had I had people come up to me at conventions when I was when I was signing autographs and they asked if they you know are you going to make a VTuber at any point? And uh, a couple of years ago, I I was a bit apprehensive to it uh, honestly at first, and uh, I slowly so started to warm up to the idea when I realized that I didn't have to pick from you know a set list. I could make my own. I could do whatever I wanted to, yeah. Uh, as long as I had the, the knew the knew the knew the right people to help me design it and put it together because I am visually and artistically inept when it comes to you know drawing or anything like that but i can sit down and get creative easily and uh so can any of you guys and you set a good example by hiring artists yeah, yeah. no yeah. please hire artists <laughs> they do it so well and it's so exciting to see like your ideas you know come to life in that way yeah, yeah. oh yeah Whenever I get sent a sketch, whenever I get sent, uh, you know, any sort of flat colors or anything like that, I'm always, I'm always <laughs> over the moon because it's a surprise. You kind of put, it's like a cake you put in the oven and then it comes back out and you're like, oh my God, look at that. It's a fucking cake. It's great. So you uh, put a cake in the oven and it just comes out sometimes. <laughs> sometimes you sit and you sit and you watch the cake as it gets made. And then, and then the cake is like, can you, can you not? I'm changing. Thank you. <laughs> Jonah's a very irresponsible baker. I am. I put it in there and I'm just like, it'll get done eventually. All right, later. Jonah, your cake. <laughs> uh, the cake will come out when it's beep, ready. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> the cake will know when the cake is done. Yeah, trust yeah. the cake. It's, it's fun kind of exploring the community as a voice actor too, because a not insignificant amount of VTubers that are career VTubers want to be voice actors and want to try and dip their toe into oh, into that world as well you're doing it the opposite it, i'm doing it the opposite way yeah it's a nice kind of exchange of ideas at that point because they are able to help me in ways that i i have i i'm inept and i can't figure figure out uh, what to do and i'm able to help them and point them in in, in the right directions uh, i'm actually working with um, a japanese company right now to possibly get a bunch of vtubers together and do what is almost like a little reality show and, and, and teach them how to voice act. <laughs> oh, oh, that'd that's be cool. so fun. Yeah. You have little cutaways and things to be like, this is what the VTubers think of the, the director who would be. And I, I, it's fun because I had the idea of like, why don't I, they, they would look at me through my VTuber and watch my VTuber perform, but I would still be, you know, filming myself and actuality because I'm, I'm still comfortable as an actor putting my face out there that's another thing that's really fun about vtubing is you have complete anonymity if you choose i i yeah. obviously am branding myself and, and putting myself <laughs> my, my own face on this and this is a, a character that i'm working as but yeah there is uh, there's no end to the possibilities yeah that's that's really cool karina you're doing the damn thing like look at that holy crap thank you <laughs> It's working. I told you that Karina's good at combining characters. Yes. I am vibing with this. <laughs> a and combining character challenge? I'm like, please, please not me. Yeah, please <laughs> put Karina. that one on Karina. Oh, She's going to crush it. some complicated shit? Yeah, give it to Karina. Yeah. It's like, well, do you want it to be good or bad? <laughs> oh, good? Okay, let's give that to Karina. Uh, <laughs> I wish I was worse at art. <laughs> <laughs> you can't go back, unfortunately. You only get better. Is Valorant the one with all the cool character designs? That's subjective, but I believe, yeah. It's the one with the guns? <laughs> it's the one with the guns. That's definitely, oh. that's yes. Oh, the gun one. I've never played Valorant. 
I've, I've actually I've actually got really good l- l- lately. My an old buddy of mine used to work at Riot, and I got I got in on beta and kind of fell off for a while, but I picked it back up because once I started VTubing, I want to play a little bit more. I want to play a little bit more Valorant. I like those Twitch yeah, you shooters. Got it. You're a VTuber. <laughs> These yeah, characters okay. are. Cool. Oh, we get it. You're a VTuber. God. Yeah, we get it. You play <laughs> video games. What video game would? inspire your vtuber persona jacob and julia yeah. mine's is ace attorney because that game changed my brain chemistry <laughs> <laughs> irreversibly oh man ace attorney is a good one yeah. just for character design <laughs> what game oh you know what it would be it would be guitaru man oh yeah <laughs> i love the That's character designs in guitaru man and they align very closely with the way i like to draw also they're all just like yeah. fucked up little weirdos <laughs> Yeah, I would definitely if I made a VTuber for myself, it would not be a, a sexy anime character. It would be a fucked up little weirdo type like helmet with wings and shit. Yeah, yeah, beautiful. It would be closer to 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 P P can on a key. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Would be a can of peas on a key. Damn, you're onto something, dude. I don't, I don't know what you. mine would be. Well, right now I'm playing a lot of Overwatch. That's a start. That is a That's roster a of heroes with unique silhouettes. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like there's some game that's like sitting in my brain that I'm like, yeah, that that's it. It has to be probably some like indie game. Hey. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, maybe like an Undertale sort of Ooh. vibe. I saw, okay, just for reference and, and how creative you, you, you definitely don't have to be. And this is no shade. <laughs> They're doing really well. I saw this VTuber the other day who is literally just a sentient chicken nugget. And Beautiful. He's, his, name is, his name is Chicken Nugget. And uh, there's him. different shapes. Obviously, you have boot, you have <laughs> circle. Naturally. Right? What else is there? There's like several different shapes of chicken nugget that are like. Is cannon. there a dino? There's, I, I don't know if there's a dino. Let me see. Chicken nugget. Fast shapes. for a special occasion. I would love if my parents walked into my room while I'm on my computer and I'm like, I'm watching a chicken nugget play Valorant. <laughs> I mean, yeah. And he's swearing up a storm and everything. Yeah. yeah. The oh chicken nugget's really engaging. <laughs> the chicken nugget noticed my super chat. Yeah. The, ch- <laughs> <laughs> the chicken Yo. nugget. I'm subscribed I- to the chicken nugget. Yeah. Tier three. It is bone, boot, ball, and bell. Those are the four B's of the nugget shapes. Bone, boot, ball, and bell. Wow. Beautiful. Canon. Tag yourself. I'm, I'm bone. Mm, maybe I'd be actually be like a, a Bayonetta. Ooh. Ooh okay. Carry. Yeah. See, that's uh, that complicated bust profile. That's very VTuber. Yeah. Got your, 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 your chains, your assorted rings. Yeah. She's just so over the top. Your hair clothes. Yeah, your hair, hair clothes. clothes. Your hair clothes. Yeah, and sometimes you could just, when you stream, you could just be the big like hair fist. Oh <laughs> yeah, there you go. That's your angry emote. That's what you, you yeah. press the angry toggle and you just become this giant raging ball of hair. Sounds like the basement of my shower, the bottom of my shower. <laughs> Ew. You almost said the basement of your shower. <laughs> my shower basement. That's, that's, a, that's an even darker place. Um, <laughs> yeah, we don't want to think about that place. It's where the hair goes to die. Question. Yeah. Nipples, no nipples. Uh, look, okay, so this is a very good question. Um, yeah, it is. Nipples. <laughs> Yeah, because anime boys never have nipples, and it upsets. As a bisexual man, that very much upsets me. Yeah, free the nip, please. Yeah, I love adding a nipple, but a lot of them just don't have them. You know what's incredible? I don't know if you've ever noticed this, Jonah, but uh, whenever I look up Joe from Skate for like drawing reference, one of the first images that comes up is one where someone drew nipples onto him. <laughs> 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 like it's just the official art but it has like nipple and some body hair added and it like cracks me up every time <laughs> this is this is what true masculinity looks like <laughs> I'm like good nipple for him and body hair. I'm glad he got that I'm glad he found that yeah let he him deserves have nipples. nipples he has big honking hondas give him nipple wow this guy looks great Karina I love the 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 parallel between the uh like mouth slits on the on the mask itself and on the, the yeah. hood itself too. That's nice. Yeah, thank you. I like to draw anime. <laughs> I can tell. You're very good at it. Thanks. So this is this is the Sinomen. <laughs> Sinomen. Whoa, you nailed it. We one. got it. He That's works... to wax, baby. That's going yeah. to print. He works part time at a gas station. <laughs> <laughs> 
Would you like to fill your tank? <laughs> Mother puppet, please. It's one of those old timey gas stations. Stay in your car. Yeah, he's he's in New Jersey. This yeah. is New Jersey. They still do that in New like Jersey, gas. right? They do still do that in New Jersey. Yes. Yeah. That's, you are not allowed to pump your own gas. <laughs> I used to live in Jersey, and when it was Pokemon Go summer, I would always just be walking around, and I'm just like, "Do not look at me, guy who has to stand outside at the gas station." Uh, <laughs> He just works like retail. <laughs> and he looks like this. He's stocking shelves at Target. Here, here's my secret to character design. That that is the true moe. We love a good gap moe. He has to like tie his hair back and like take off the costume to do his day job and then he like does this in the evening. Yep. Yep. Now, my VTuber uh, has a casual outfit as well as his like complicated, what I like to call in the VTuber universe, everybody has one of their, they have a hero outfit, right? <laughs> so their hero outfit is what they're presented in and a lot of like key visuals and art and things like that. Yeah. And then they have the like, casual wear where they can wear pretty much anything else because you get the whole, the gap moe is there. Yeah, but that's why when I've been working on the stuff for you, I'm just like, and here he is without his bangs. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Because <laughs> I think it's cute when his forehead shows. <laughs> yeah, I think so too. And that's the best part about having that's something true, that you Moe. own. Is, uh, you can do whatever you want. You can pick true. how much forehead is shown. As a lifelong Apollo Justice stan, I know the good shit when I see it. <laughs> <Forehead>. Yes. <laughs> Oh, man. Okay, here's your VTuber, whoever this is for. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Beautiful. It's yeah. so good, Please Karina. draw fan art of him working his retail job without his costume on. I think Thank it's you. great Thank because you. I want him. He looks he looks like Sino, but I, I no shade, Alejandro. He sounds like Jason when he's talking. <laughs> <laughs> She's got this like, what are you doing? Kind of like, you know, throaty voice that yeah. doesn't match his face at all i love it yeah that's his do, character voice i want him to work at like a yankee candle oh my god <laughs> <laughs> that's my uh, all right culture. is it my turn yes i think all it's right. your turn all right so what am i doing okay so i have noticed that it is not uncommon for you to engage some engage some religious iconography there are many demon vtubers i love that there are are many yeah. uh there are many angel vtubers uh, and uh, one of which Iron Mouse uh, was an angel VTuber to some extent. I was I recently uh, voiced uh, uh, the angel, the archangel Gabriel in uh, one of her outfits reveal uh, videos. Uh, it was great, oh great chance God. to work with her. Gabriel from Bible. Yeah, Gabriel from Bible. You know, everyone's <laughs> favorite, everyone's favorite book. <laughs> the one thing that I have been actually like very curious to see is I want to see a uh, biblically accurate angel John. <laughs> I feel okay. like in your infinite expertise of the the monstrous and uh, the eldritch, you would be <laughs> one of the best people to sketch this out for us. Thank you, thank you. You're very welcome. Thank you for your expertise. Okay. <laughs> thank you for your service, Julia. Yeah, and thank you, Jacob. Thank you. We thank were talking you, earlier thank about you. like the anime eye, but yeah, in the Bible, <laughs> in the Bible. The angels have many eyes, lots of eyes, yeah. unblinking. All of them, all of them, moe. All of them. That poor artist that has to render out those moe eyes. Yeah. Anime is not biblically accurate. <laughs> the word anime is not in the Bible. You can't, you Furthest cannot thing find from it. the Bible, I would imagine. Okay, years of Catholic school. Same, same. Finally, finally yeah. coming to fruition here. <laughs> I'm going to take this back. I'm going to print this out. Once you render it, I'm going to print this out and go back to my Catholic high school and be like, <laughs> yep. hey, you need to post this up because it technically is accurate. This is technically correct. Oh, right. The concentric <laughs> rings in on each other. Okay. Yeah. Julia yeah. loves the concentric rings surrounding <laughs> She's a an big open fan. flame. <laughs> it's my go-to biblically accurate angel. I don't know if anyone else has a go-to, but I do. When I drew one, it looked kind of like a stupid lion. <laughs> yeah, you had like some a other lion head goat. stuck to it. Yeah. I do forget how many rings it has. It's, it's got seven. enough. It can't be seven. Seven That's is a lot. too many. <laughs> don't make me draw seven. No, I think it's five, maybe. Yeah, it's five. It's five. You're right. What's yeah. Ring's angel's name? Ring angel's name? Hold on. What's ring in Japanese? Ringu? Yeah, yeah, Ringu. 
<laughs> it's Yubiwa. Yubiwa chan. <laughs> that's amazing. Yubiwa chan. Oh, God. That's adorable. I like it. That's cute. That's, that's Moe. <laughs> True Moe achieved. Yeah, you may have all the Catholic school knowledge, but I know my Moe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Did I ever tell you there was one summer I was talking to my dad? You know, I call my parents every week. I love talking with them. I should do them. that. I should do that. Go on. Yeah. And my dad was like, you know, I was at Barnes and Noble and I saw this book on Moe anime. So I got it. <laughs> And I was like, that's great, Dad. <laughs> Beautiful. And it was like closely before Father's Day when he told me that. So on Father's Day, I sent him an email where I was just like, happy Father's Day. I'm going to make one of these for you and drink a beer with it. And it was one of those like anime girl shrines that people make for their birthdays where they just line up all the merch and have a cake <laughs> with it. And I was like, I'll do this for you, Dad. Oh my <laughs> You're God. my Moe anime. Girl. <laughs> Shout oh out to my, my dad God. who's probably watching this episode. Hi. Hi, Dad. Hi. Unless you skipped this portion of the video. <laughs> no, he goes to my drawing section. Yeah, he's a Julia fan. <laughs> he does not watch whole videos, but he does like Julia's drawings. Oh, man. I'll take it. He's and a mine, Julia stan. So another fun, uh, another fun VTuber fact. Speaking of uh, many-eyed uh, beasts that tell us not to be afraid. Uh, <laughs> to track your face, I had to discover a lot about you know the software, how to how to make sure all of this stuff works, how to make sure the rigging works, how to make sure it's tracking your eyes effectively. And one of the best cameras that you can get for that is an iPhone. That is oh. bar none. It's 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 huh. an iPhone. Interesting. They have some of the best like face ID uh, used as like an external <laughs> webcam, and their like infrared illuminated sensors that they have has really precise. Uh, motion okay. capture and my rigging artist was like do you want to make because he knew as an as an as an actor he's like i know you're an actor um he he's he's in japan he's very very good at what he does um and he's like i, I can make this incredibly detailed for you it'll take a little bit of time which is one reason why we're not debuting for a while but um i can make this incredibly <laughs> detailed for you but you'd have to download a few programs so i had to get pretty good at figuring out uh, how to hook all that stuff up, um, how to make sure that my face is accurately tracked. But I got a work in progress of the model to, to, to fool around with. And oh my God, it is eerily accurate. It is down to like yeah. eyebrow furrows and stuff. It's, it's crazy. <laughs> That's wild. Yeah. I have seen this and I was very impressed with it because no shade to any VTubers out there, but it does weird me out when the eyes aren't tracking properly. I feel like I've seen that a lot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> That's beautiful. <laughs> oh, my God. I want this to be a fucking viral meme. <laughs> yeah. Would you buy an Enderoid of her? Let us know. <laughs> yeah. You'd have to have several. You know how they have those, like, external, like, spikes that hold it up? You'd have to have several of those. Yeah. Um, <laughs> The absolute nightmare it would be to have this figure. <laughs> <laughs> Wake up with a start in the middle of the night and it like starts vibrating. No. <laughs> be, be not afraid. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, Julia, the Among Us trick. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yes. You, right. you can probably like invert the Among Us too. That probably give you something spicy. Ooh, an inverted Among Us. It's my favorite skateboard trick. <laughs> okay. To drop the tube and do an inverted bogus. <laughs> I can't wait for that. It's Kate season two. <laughs> Another fun uh, VTuber and acting fact. Mm -hmm. oh, wow. Much like WWE wrestlers, they have this fiction. A lot of VTubers have this fictional kind of uh, aura, this universe that they kind of bring along with them. Um, in Japan, it is called Kefabe, and it is this kind of suspension of disbelief that you have when you go and watch a VTuber. You go and kind of escape into their world. A uh, friend of the show, my show, Project Melody. Uh, Mel has their own universe. Uh, and even I will be debuting with this thing. Some people take it a little bit more seriously than others. Uh, much like some WWE wrestlers 
are a little bit more of a persona, a little bit less of a persona. They have fiction with other VTubers or they, they, other wrestlers, other VTubers. You know what I mean. <laughs> they have collabs. The WWE yeah. collabs. <laughs> so would you say that wrestlers were the original VTubers? Yes, I would. <laughs> yes, I would. <laughs> that is, oh my God, we should write a book. Hmm. Trophy <laughs> comes out with its first like majorly published book and it's about this <laughs> non-fiction <Yeah. laughs> an analysis don't mind me just drawing a lot of eyes doing I also, great sweaty I also decided not to do another circle in the interest <laughs> smart, of time smart, before yeah. anyone gets at me <laughs> yeah you just do as many as you feel like that's the rule I yeah. think for drawing this yeah. angel yeah. you got time later anyway yeah, you got a post. Yeah. I will say that my first exposure to VTubers was Project <laughs> Melody, and I don't want to unpack what that says about me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was a big fan of, of Melody, and uh, I'm, I'm yeah. a big fan of, of uh, Iron Mouse and, you know, all of the top VTubers I would watch consistently. I, I, it, one person I would watch in particular who is not like one of the top VTubers, but is a very good friend of mine is, is Fleshy. Um, Fleshy is not what it sounds. Fleshy is a cute cat girl. Uh, Fleshy <laughs> is a, a very good friend of mine. And uh, we have been, we've been uh, hanging out for a very long time. Uh, they have an adorable voice. They're fantastic. But I, I would watch a bunch of these, these VTubers and I was very shocked and honored that they were fans of mine too. And that blew my mind, seeing these people that I looked up to personally and that I watched on a regular basis. I would watch compilations and, and the collabs and everything while I was eating breakfast. And, you know, I, I, that, that was my consumption. That was what I did. It really was crazy to see. One, one time I got raided by Iron Mouse and it was like 10,000 people. Wow. And That's I was crazy. like, oh, my God. And she's like, yeah, we should work together. We should. I, I love your work. I, I, I want to, I wanna, you know, get to know you guys and, and hang out with you. I hear you're debuting a VTuber soon. Welcome to the community. And that's another thing is that the VTuber community is one of the most inclusive. I mean, second only to maybe the furry community. It doesn't matter if you have 10,000 viewers. doesn't matter if you have 20 viewers. They're all so nice. Hell yeah. Hear that, Drawfee awesome. community? Step it up. <laughs> <laughs> Furries, you're doing great. <laughs> yeah, it is so cool when you, you know, find out that you've you're like mutual fans with someone that you yeah, watch and yeah. look up to. Like whenever we get to have people on Droppy as guests, that it's like, <laughs> it's crazy that you even know who we are and what we do. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's always a little surreal. <laughs> yeah. I love how you turned the flames into the hair. <laughs> She's so I had to cute. get it in somewhere and... <laughs> It almost looks like a Yu-Gi-Oh card. <laughs> it does. <laughs> this is one of them newfangled Yu-Gi-Oh cards where it's just like an anime girl, but they also kind of tapped into the old Yu-Gi-Oh art where it's like a fucked up little guy. Yeah. <laughs> God forgive me. It's just going to look like, like hieroglyphics or something, but if, I, if you squint, you're like, is that a Mogus? <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> I see what you did. <laughs> I see what you did there. Uh, yeah. She's beautiful. I'm trying to figure out how to do the mouth if I want to do like. Oh, that was the the little cat mouth. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I love one it. thing. One, one thing. thing. <laughs> <laughs> it just floats around down there. Yeah. yeah. You I could think have this like is her. The, the eye and the mouth could free float. This is yeah. she. Yeah, this is it. She's gorge. I love it. It's amazing. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <laughs> We're kicking um, off a new era of VTubers. Yeah. Yes. These are going to join our previous VTuber concepts that we came up with. Yeah, put as... them in the rogues gallery, man. Yeah. <laughs> what was it? My favorite one was DJ Night Garbage. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wait, what? Uh, oh, I think I've seen a... DJ Night Garbage. He's a guy that got cursed to wear a raccoon mask that formed with his body and he's been trapped and now he's a DJ and he makes songs about being cursed. <laughs> <laughs> and everyone's like, wow, this song's like so experimental. And he's like, it's a, it's not a metaphor. <laughs> this is autobiographical. This is true. Yeah. This is how I feel. Yeah, and he can't talk. So. <laughs> oh my God. He just kind of breathes heavily and whispers. Yeah, while I he enjoy plays... DJ Night Garbage too. <laughs> yeah, while he plays games. His last single is flat. <laughs> yeah, I get, please get this mask off my face. It's been 10 years and I'm cursed. <laughs> that song was so weird, but I liked it. It's a banger. <laughs> well, Jonah, thank you so much for coming on to the show. Yeah. Thank uh, you guys. 
Just in case anyone wasn't listening in the beginning, where can people find you? I am streaming on Twitch as <laughs> twitch.tv slash alpha anarchy. Uh, speaking of anarchy, my character is a very big brother type. The log line is the best big brother you've never had. So nice. he's, he's very, he's very cool. Yeah. Move over IRL big brother. Exactly. I am IRL a big brother. Um, <laughs> I'm also on Twitter at I'm Mr. Transistor. And uh, yeah, that, that, that hasn't changed yet. <laughs> Great. And then if you want to catch more of us, uh, we stream on Twitch at 7 p.m. Eastern time on Monday. And uh, if you want to support us and what we do, you can like and subscribe. You can leave a comment down below of what you would like to see us draw or collab with. And uh, we also would not be able to do this without our patreon so consider supporting us on patreon patreon.com slash drothy please with yeah. your support we can finally become vtubers yeah make anime real yes Join we us. also have merch grab some merch it's yeah. all in the description all the links are in the description <laughs> figure it out it's there we're sorry 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 i'm not